friends and welcome back to my channel. My name is Annalise and today's video is really exciting because I'm doing a Pretty Little Thing haul as you would know because you clicked on this video but basically Pretty Little Thing is one of my favorite websites. I'm always shopping on there and I've never done a haul from them. I don't really know why I've never picked up my camera to film that since there's packages coming from them constantly but that is what I'm doing today. So I went on to Pretty Little Thing and I bought quite a few items. I didn't realize how much I'd bought until two massive bags arrived. So that is what I have today. So without further ado, let's get on into it because I'm dying to see these items. Let's start with this really big bag and see what we have in here. And this is the item. It is this massive plaid puffer jacket. And you guys, it's even puffier in real life than in the photo, which is what I wanted because it is going into winter in Australia and I really wanted a thick, nice looking jacket to wear. And I think that this is perfect. It literally feels like a blanket, which means it's gonna be so comfy to wear. So this caught my attention because the material looks like Burberry, but this did not have Burberry prices. So I love that. And I just thought it would look great. It would look really good, you know, just with like jeans and a top, but also it could look good with a dress. The possibilities are just endless. So let's go put it on and see how it fits. This is what the jacket looks like on it. So this is the front and this is the back. And I am really happy to report that it is just like wearing a blanket. This jacket is so comfortable. I'm really glad that they put the lining on the inside of this because I think that's what makes it comfy. The ad is just a little bit scratchy, so I think if it was all over, it wouldn't be as nice. I've just noticed though that on this jacket, it's meant to have like adjustable um, elastic on the side here where you can pull it down and make it tied up, but mine is broken, which is really disappointing because I don't think this jacket was cheap and as you guys can see here so it's meant to be like a two-piece thing that you can pull and that little bit there has snapped off that's definitely really disappointing when it's shown up broken all already but apart from that i do like this it is so warm i'm starting to sweat actually because it gets quite warm in my filming room with all the lights and stuff and this on Ooh, it's getting toasty, so it'll definitely keep you warm, that's for sure. The next item I have is very smelly. My, I've just taken it out of the packet and my entire room smells like chemicals, so I'm not too sure what's going on there, but this is the item. It is a pair of long leopard print pants, and pretty little thing, they're not playing no games. They have this like black strap that goes right through one of the legs here. That And it's so that if you break this, you can't return it. So that's interesting. But I loved these pants because as I said, it's cooling down this time of year. So this with like a black long sleeve bodysuit or even a short sleeve bodysuit, I thought would be such a look. It would look so stylish and I needed some more long pants. And with this design, it's gonna feel like I'm wearing my PJ. Oh my God, that. <coughs> Oh, that smell is really strong. It's making me cough. Oh my God, my eyes are watering. I don't know what was in that bag or these, is it the, it's these pants. Oh my God, okay, I, I'm gonna need to wash these ASAP. But these really smell and I don't know why. But anyway, as I was saying, <laughs> Um, these will feel like wearing pajama pants, which is really good. It will mean it's super comfy, I hope. I just presume by the style that that's how it will feel. So let's go try these on and see what we think. And I'm gonna open a window because I feel so, oh, that smell. And this is what the pants look like on it. I am obsessed with them. Okay, that was a little weird, but I think that just shows my energy in these pants. So as I pull these out of the packet, I said that I really hope they would feel like pajama pants, and I'm proud to report that they do. They are super comfortable and lightweight, but still look really stylish because what I didn't say, but I was thinking, is that I hope they don't also look like pajama pants, and I really don't think that they do. I love these pants so much. I think they look really, really good on. I think these pants would actually be perfect to wear to, you know, drinks with friends, going out to dinner, fun little events like that where you don't want to get too, too dressed up, 
but you still want to look good. So I am very impressed with these pants and cannot wait to wear them. I'm already trying to figure out if I have any events or I'm going to anything at all where I can wear these pants soon because I just adore them. Next up, we have a set because it's not an Annalise Wood haul if a set is not included. This set actually has a little bit of a story behind it, but I'll show you guys what it is first. So this set is these bottoms right here. So it's a pair of shorts and then this top that just has the one sleeve and I think it's gorgeous. So this set, the story behind it is not long. It's just that occasionally, not often, but occasionally my friends and I will go out on a Sunday to a Sunday sesh, which is basically just like I don't know how to describe it, like a day clubbing, I guess you would say, but it's a lot more chill and you can just like chat with your friends. So I love the like fashion of that. Everyone dresses so nice and so like colorful and stuff. So I always look online for outfits that I want to wear, but I never buy them until I know that we're going on a Sunday set. Then every time without fail, those outfits are sold out. So I was telling my friend Ellie that this would be perfect next time we go to a Sunday sesh and she was like, we'll buy it now. I'll stop like waiting until they sell out. So I did. So shout out to Ellie. She's the reason I bought this set. And if it's bad, it's on her. No, I'm totally kidding. But it does look pretty good. It is a little cheaper made than I expected. The material isn't double lined. It's not going to be see-through or anything like that. It's just, I don't know. I just thought it would be better quality than it is. But I do like the gold detailing on it. And I think that it will look so cute, especially this top because the sleeve can go puffy, which I love. So I think we should just go try this on and see what we think. And this is what the highly awaited set, as in I've been waiting for it, not you guys. The highly awaited set for me looks like on. This is the front and this is the back. Now this set, I know a lot of you guys aren't going to like and are likely going to be very vocal in the comment sections as per usual, but I really like it. I like it because it's different and that's why I think a lot of you guys won't. The top especially, I love the design of, especially with this puffy sleeve. The pants, I don't love how they're like poking out like this. I think that's just because of the way they were packaged, so I might iron them just so that way they can come down a little because I think if they were just like normal shorts, it makes it look a lot cuter and less like a pixie outfit. <laughs> but as I was putting this on, I did notice a few things that I wanted to share with you guys. One is that it has no room to move. Like it is very tight fitting and it has no elastic in it at all to budge. So make sure that you order the right size. I think that this is true to size. I got this in an Australian a size six and that's what I always wear. So it is true to size, but just make sure it's your size. And then the second thing I noticed is that it's quite itchy. All of this gold material, when it's on your skin, it's quite irritating and itchy. And I think if you were wearing this out, it would become quite annoying after a while. Am I still planning to wear this out? Yes, but it's just something to keep in mind. As always with these sets, you are able to mix and match them, which is why I love buying sets so much. This top would look really cute with like a plain white skirt and these shorts would look great with a white bodysuit. So, you know, that way you can get multiple different outfits out of the one, which I love. The next item that I got is a sweater. So I am very excited for this one. This is what it looks like. So it's this nice black and white pattern with long sleeves, obviously, because it's a sweater, duh. I don't know why I said that. And it is cropped. So I thought that this was super cute. It actually came in a brown and nude color, which is what first caught my attention, but that was not available in my size. So this is the next best thing. It is a nice knit material. It's not too thick, which is what I wanted. If you're after a bit of a thicker sweater, I don't think this would be the one for you because it's quite thin but it is so soft. It's like a knit blanket. I love it. I really love in winter having some clothes that are a little bit comfier. Do I always wear comfy clothes in winter? No, no I do not. But if I can attempt to look good and be comfy at the same time, I'm all for it. So I think that this sweater will do that perfectly because I was thinking that this with maybe a pair of jeans would be an easy stylish winter outfit. But I'm really excited to try this on. I think it looks really good. So let's just go put it on and see what we think. And and this is what the sweater looks like on it. It is super, super comfy. And I honestly think a lot of that stems from the long sleeves that it has. I feel like Ariana Grande, you know how you like never see her hands? There's always like a meter of sweater. That's 
what I feel like in this top. So I am very happy with it. One thing to keep in mind is that it's probably not the warmest if you live in a colder climate, just because this runs straight through to the arms pretty much. It's like this much space here, and then it's in the sleeve, if that makes sense. So it probably won't keep you the coolest, but where I live, it really doesn't get too, too cold in winter, so this should be a okay. So I am just really happy with this item. I love how comfy and cozy it is, and I just love the general aesthetic of it. I think it looks very stylish on a very simple note. It'll make any winter outfit look really stylish, really easy, which I love. It'll be good for those days where I don't really want to put together an outfit. I just want to put on something, still look good, and go. So this jeans, ah. Oh, we are set to go, so I am very happy with this one. The next item that I bought is a bodysuit, and this is what it looks like. So it is strapless, and it has, oh, let me move the tag, it's kind of ruining the effect, <laughs> but it's strapless, and it's meant to like stand up like that, and I thought this looked so high fashion, and I really wanted it, but now that it's here, I'm a little concerned that these bits aren't gonna stick up, because there's no boning or any sort of material to keep it standing up. So I guess I'd have to use like fashion tape or something. But apart from that, the material is nice. It's a crepe material and they've double lined it on the top here. As you guys can see, they've put the extra little bit of lining and then the rest is just one. So it might be slightly see-through everywhere else, but that's not really a big deal. As long as you can't see my chest, it's fine. So not gonna lie, I'm a little bit disappointed that they haven't put any sort of structure in it to keep this top up because I don't know what they think is gonna happen, you know? Like, I think most people would have expected something in it to keep it up. But let's go put it on and see what happens because maybe it's not gonna be a big issue and maybe it will just stay up. I don't know, so let's see. This is what the top looks like on it, but before we go any further, I just wanted to point out these marks I have on my arm. I was changing the angle for my camera and just dropped my ring light on my arm, which is why I have these red marks here. Just in case you guys notice them, whenever there are any marks on my body, I get lot of my bodies on my body, I get lots of concerned comments, which is very sweet. So I just wanted to point out in case you see that. I'm okay, I'm just an idiot that dropped my ring light on my arm and it stings a lot, but we're gonna push through. So anyway, the reason you are here, this top. As predicted, it falls. <laughs> it's so disappointing. I really really loved this top online and could not wait for it to come and I just expected that there would be some sort of boning, some sort of something to keep this top up but instead it is sitting up but it just falls easily. All it would need is like a breeze to come and it would fall over so I'm very very disappointed in that. Maybe I can find some metal and I'll do a really like dodgy DIY where I just glue a strip of metal on the back here that way it will stay up because I love this design. I think that this outfit right here, which is a white skirt obviously with this top, looks gorgeous and could pass for like a really nice dress, but I don't want to spend the whole night worrying that this is going to fall down and look really weird when it's meant to be like a classy outfit. So hopefully I can find a way to fix it, but I just wouldn't recommend this top because of that. You don't want to go online buy something and have it show up like this. Next, I have another set, and this is a pink tracksuit set. So matching tracksuit sets have been super popular lately in that sort of athleisure style, and I love them. I think they look really cute, but I also think that brands overcharge for them. So when I saw that Pretty Little Thing came out with their own, like, collection, I guess you'd say, of tracksuit sets, I knew that I wanted to test it out to see if this is a dupe for all those other brands. So firstly, I got Got this pink crop top this is what it looks like and then to go with that I got a pair of pink tracksuit pants so my first impression is that this top doesn't appear to be the best material it is slightly see-through but maybe you'll be able to get away with it because of the pigment since it's you know a nice pink color it might be as obvious that it's see-through also I didn't notice when I bought it but this is recycled by pretty little things so on this little tag here it says that they made this top out of um, clothing and pattern cutting straps. So that's really cool. Wow, I had no idea. That's Well, that's awesome. I love that. Are the pants recycled as well? Yeah, the tracksuit pants are recycled. Oh my god, that's so cool. I had no idea. Wow, okay. Even another reason to ditch the other brands and buy the tracksuits from here. 
So the pink chat suit, they don't look to be see-through, which is great. And the inside, oh, it's not soft. It's not a soft inside, but it's not like rough or anything, but you know, I kind of wished it was like a nice soft material, but I'm pretty happy with the tracksuit pants. They look very cute. I, I love this color. I think this color is gorgeous. So let's go put these on and see how they look. And this is what the recycled pink tracksuit set looks like on. Now it's not the best quality material but considering the price and that it was made from other recycled materials it's pretty good. I think we may have found a dupe for all those really expensive athleisure tracksuit sets that those boutiques are selling because although this isn't the best quality it's good enough like it'll get you by you know. The tracksuit pants are actually really good quality they're just not soft on the inside that's my only real critique of them but Apart from that, I really like them and they have pockets and they're not see-through at all so I'm really happy with these. The top is a little bit more see-through. I don't think you can actually see through my top but just so you know, if you do order this, it's not the best quality. Could have been better if they double lined it. Y'all know I love when things are double lined but they did it. So it is a little bit cheaper fabric but it's enough to get by if you're just wanting a cheap crop top because I'm pretty sure this was cheap. So Pretty Little Thing came out with like a full on recycled collection like lots of other items that were made from recycled clothing so let me know if you guys want to see a full review on that but I don't think you really need it because like you've got this set here to go off and I definitely think it's worth it. If you are looking for a tracksuit set I would recommend going with this lot instead of spending like, you know, some companies want over $100 for a tracksuit set. And now for the lucky last item, this one right here. I think this explains again why I had such big bags because a few of these items are pretty large. And this is the item. So it is a white teddy sort of material jacket that is cropped. So this jacket is really, really nice material. So it's a nice teddy material that is thick and will keep you warm, which I love. So they've lined the inside again with some nice satiny lining, which is good because this is a little bit scratchy, the outside material. So that way it's not on the inside and you won't get all scratched up. But I thought this was great. I'm always in need of a white jacket and one that'll keep me warm will be amazing and especially since it's cropped it just makes it look that little bit more trendy than if it was oversized you know I also got this because I feel like teddy jackets are like eternally on trend but everyone has them so I didn't really want to get one of the brown ones that everybody has so I thought this was a perfect Annalise version of the trend so I love this and I can't wait to put it on. It kind of looks like I've sheared a sheep, but it's definitely not sheep, so don't worry about that. <laughs> All right, this is what the white jacket looks like on. And as you can see, I'm wearing it with the pink tracksuit set from earlier because I actually bought these three to wear together as a cute little set. So I get lots of questions uh, on my channel asking if I really wear the clothes that I buy for these hauls. And the answer is yes, I don't buy any clothes outside of YouTube because I don't need to. So every item that you see, I am buying to hopefully wear. So this outfit is no exception. I love it. I cannot wait to wear this. I think it's so cute, especially with this jacket. It is super warm, which I love, and it is just so comfortable. So the inside, as I've already mentioned, is lined, which is great because it just makes it so comfy. That way you can feel all of the fluff and warmth from it, but it's not rubbing on your skin. Instead, you've got some lining to protect, protect you, I guess, from it, and I really like it. And that is the end of my Pretty Little Thing haul. I really hope you guys enjoyed this. If you did, I'll be sure to make more in the future, because as I said, I'm always buying items off of Pretty Little Thing. So if you enjoyed this video, be sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel, because I upload two videos every single week. And if you want to see more of my face, all these outfits in action, then be sure to follow me on Instagram, Pinterest, and Twitter. My links are on the screen right now. I'm also linked down below. And that's the end of today's video. I really hope you guys enjoyed it as much as I did making it, and I'll see you next time. Bye!